Good day everyone! I am Teacher Mary Abigail and I am your teacher for today's lesson. Are you ready to learn? Come on, let's learn and have some fun! Today, we are going to discuss Dynamics. What is Dynamics? Dynamics refers to the softness or loudness of the music. It suggests varied emotions, characters, or sensation. It may provide listeners with anxiety, emotions, stillness, affections, energy, or victory. Always remember that it is important to use varied dynamic levels to avoid having the same sound at all times, making the listeners find it boring to listen to. There are dynamic marking or symbols that you will see in any musical score. Take a look at the table. It is the dynamic markings and symbols. First, we have the dynamic levels and changes. Dynamic marking or symbols and meaning on how to sing or perform the parts. Let's move on to the dynamic levels and changes. First, we have piano. Its marking or symbols is P. And meaning or how to sing its part is soft. Second, we have mezzo piano. Its marking or symbols is MP. And how to sing or perform the part is moderately soft. Third, we have pianissimo. Its marking or symbols is PP. And how to sing or perform the part is very soft. Fourth, we have forte. Its marking or symbols is F. And its meaning is loud. Fifth, we have mezzo forte. Its marking or symbols is MF. And its meaning or how to sing or perform the part is moderately loud. Sixth, we have fortissimo. Marking or symbols is FF. And its meaning or how to sing or perform the part is very loud. Next, we have crescendo. Its marking or symbols is cresc. Its meaning on how to sing or perform the part is to gradually play from soft to loud. Last, we have the crescendo or the midwendo. Its marking or symbols is decrease or dim. Its meaning on how to sing or perform the part is to gradually play from loud to soft. The more versatile singers know how to use the dynamic levels well, making them more fun and entertaining to watch for, and at the same time, avoiding them to easily get tired when performing. 